here today to answer a question from a bride to be the wedding is set to be in december her groom is working a decent job she just graduated from university congratulations on that they have a guest count of a hundred people they had to cut down due to covid restrictions and she wants to know how she can further cut down costs Thank you for the question and this is the answer that I have for you. So with the guest count, I truly think you will be able to create a wedding that you can really enjoy, you know, as far as your budget is concerned. So that guest count is really nice. But the most important thing is to sit down with your groom-to-be, your husband-to-be, and find out from him what his vision is for the wedding day. Find out from him, since he's gonna pay most of the wedding costs anyway, what, how much money he is comfortable to spend. You know, I know as women, we like to go off the hinges, create a whole vision by ourselves, you know, and establish that in ourselves before we go to our husbands or our grooms-to-be and try to, try to get them to see everything from our point of view which is not even fair, you know? So sit him down, find out from him what his vision is as well, and be willing to be sober-minded from all the highs you see on Instagram for weddings and on Facebook as well. Be willing to be sober, you know, and focus on the budget that you have. That will set a great foundation from which you will build this wedding planning journey. Once you know from him what, how much he is comfortable with spending when it comes to the wedding, take that and find a planner who will be able to give you something that will be close to the vision that you guys agreed to, you know, for the money. There are two ways you can go about this. You can either choose to go with a wedding planner option and the wedding planner will also put together a group of vendors who will come together and deliver for your wedding vision according to the budget. You can do that, or if you're willing to cut out the wedding planner's cost and try to find a wedding day of coordinator, you can also do that. But with that, you have to singly find a photographer, a videographer, a decorator, a caterer, the venue. You have to find all the, the DJ, Every vendor that comes into play as far as your wedding is concerned, you have to do that leg work by yourself, you know, and find them, put them together according to your budget. But makes the wedding planner important is they get to work with a lot of vendors and so they have an established relationship. They can talk to each other and come together to create something that works well for your budget. So really consider that and know that just because you're trying to cut costs does not mean you're gonna go the cheap way because it really does not end up working well, you know, on the wedding day. Quality is always important no matter what. It doesn't matter how small it is, how big it is. Quality is always important. Forget quantity, quality is always the best and wins any day. So say I do.